Welcome back to the channel, my name is Abum, welcome back to Uncharted Drake's Fortune. Last time we met Mr. Nathan Drake, we met Sully, we met Elena, and we are on the road looking for El Dorado, which, you know, is thought to be the lost city of gold. Turns out it's actually a statue of gold worth probably millions now. Uh, so that's what we're looking for. Uh, Nathan Drake is the uh, descendant of Sir Francis Drake, or so he says, and he is on a... Uh, expedition uh, with journalist Elena Fisher looking for uh, we're well, looking for Francis Drake's coffin they found it it was empty no Drake inside but there was a journal which led to El Dorado or, or led to uh, this hunt for El Dorado so we're looking for this statue now which has been probably taken away sort of hundreds of years earlier but we're going to follow these tracks we're going to go down see what we can find if you're enjoying this don't forget to drop a like and leave comments it's the best way to support the channel and if you haven't done so already or if you're new then do subscribe and turn on notifications and let's jump on let's crack on see what we can find well this is good news we're outside again huh they stop here yeah it looks like the back wall of the temple was blown out yeah Spaniards must have made themselves a shortcut to get the treasure out. Well, now what? Right, gonna find a way to see where this treasure's gone now. The tracks have gone. So what did they do? This is 400 years ago. There's no aircraft. They didn't lift it. We don't know where it went. So let's try and find out where it went. Maybe there's another hidden door somewhere. I see a flashing tre treasure over that way. Let's go and find the treasure. There it is. We've got a silver turtle. So that's three out of 60 treasures. Uh, but it looks like the path does lead up this way. So let's head up and see see what we've got up here. I remember. I think I remember what bit this is. Wait, Sully, do you hear that? Waterfall. It's a waterfall. I hear water. There's something you don't see every day. Yeah, it's the U-boat. So how did that get up here? And like, again, how old is that thing? Ridiculously old, I think. Um, so, you know, talking about the game, right? I first played this back in... Oh, I'll wait for the cutscene first of all. to come up the river during flood season and got us stuck. Let's check it out, huh? Yeah, uh, wait, wait, wait. Something about this feels kind of hinky. Hinky? You act like you've never seen a German U-boat in the middle of the jungle before. Uh, I'm being serious, Nate. <laughs> I tell you what, why don't you stay here? I'll check it out myself. I'll call you if I run into any Nazis. Yeah, right. You do that. Or Nazi zombies. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on to this for me, will you? Okay. So Looks like I'm gonna have to do this the hard way. So Drake has probably been here. Or has been here because he wrote stuff down in his journal. Uh the Spanish have been here. And the Germans are here. And they are, the, are they all here for the same thing? What are the Nazis doing here? No idea. I'm not gonna jump down there. That is gonna kill me. Uh, but yeah, as I was gonna say, um I first played this game. Uh, it came out in 2007. I first played it, I think it was about 2010. Because uh, I didn't get a PlayStation 3 until uh, a few years after it originally came out. I hope Drake's had his tetanus shot. Um, am I even doing the right thing here? I think I've, I don't think this is correct. Um, I think you've got to swim over this way. Uh, yeah, there is a bit of swimming involved. Uh, yeah, I think it was about 2010, because Uncharted 2, the sequel, came out in 2009. And I watched an old Let's Play of that years ago. There's a guy on YouTube who I used to watch when I was younger. His name is Psychedelic Snake. Um, he's still active in Twitter, but doesn't really post YouTube videos anymore. But um, he played Uncharted 2, and that's the first time that I'd really seen Uncharted. And I didn't watch the whole series. I can do that. A little bit of parkour, I guess. Um, I didn't watch the whole series because I got, you know, a good way through the game and decided, you know what, I'm not going to watch the rest of this. I want to 
experience this game for myself. So I went to get Uncharted 2 and I picked up uh, the first game uh, at the same time. Uh, they were both pre-owned, I think, from HMV. So I played Uncharted Drake's Fortune first and then played all the way through Uncharted 2, which was... I, I think Uncharted 2 is the best of uh, probably of all four Uncharted. Number four comes very, very close because it is an astounding game. But um, I think Uncharted 2, for its time, is probably one of the best stories in a video game like ever. Um, so that was like the first time that I played this. And if you haven't played this, like if, if this sort of passed you by as well, then I do recommend checking it out. I mean, by all, by all means, you know, you can watch this, but... Even if you do watch this whole series, I do recommend playing it for yourself as well. I don't know what I'm meant to be doing here. Do I just climb up? Uh, I guess we've got to jump over to the left because it does look like there's a bit of a ledge there. But we need to build up a bit of uh, momentum first of all. There we go. Okay, that's what he got to do. But yeah, if you do watch this series, and you know, if you watch this the whole way through, and you you you, you know find out the story from this playthrough, I'd still recommend going out and playing it for yourself if you can because it is a fantastic game um, Drake's having a bit of fun climbing up these hillsides um, yeah it, it borrows I, I would say it borrows from like the old Tomb Raider games but I feel like the new Tomb Raider games um, there's a gold Tyrone pendant there the new Tomb Raider games I say new the 2013 one that we played recently um, does borrow a lot from these games so that Tomb Raider very much feels like a mix of like the old Drake's dead uh, it does feel like a mix of the old Tomb Raider games and this so that's what I think right we're going to do all this climbing again because I just fell um, I can't remember exactly where I'm going to go here but let's see what we can do oh I think we had to go around to the left so there might oh, oh so there's a tre oh I see I remember I remember there was a treasure on that side but we need to go to this side to get a bit further and get to that U boat that's what I had to do it's a long way down. yeah I know it is I fell okay yeah no, this is correct uh, oh that looks a bit precarious oh god <laughs> I didn't mean to do that I was not sure if I, I think you have to hang and get across there. Or just jump across. But there are some games where Drake can sort of back up against the wall and sidestep that way. Uh, okay. Uh, drop down and up to here. Down to there. Down to here. And then we should be able to get onto the U boat. There we go. Yeah, like I said, hopefully Drake's had his tetanus shot. Um, I think there's a treasure at the front of this ship. Pretty sure there is. So let's go and find it. I'm pretty sure there is. Yeah, I can see it flashing. See, I, I remember bits and pieces of this game. There's bits that I don't remember. Uh, a gold and turquoise Inca earring. There we go. Beginner fortune hunter. I think that's five treasures we've got now. Out of 60. But again, like, like I said last time, I'm not going to go out of my way to find all these, but if I remember where any are... And they're not too difficult to get. And then we'll certainly grab them. Right, we're going into the U-boat now. Hopefully there's no zombie Nazis okay. in here. Or Nazi in. zombies. Not sure which is worse. Nasty happened to these guys. There's blood everywhere. And soup. What? Which is which? Is it tomato soup? Because that might be blood as well. Uh, okay. Should we be opening this? Like, I would, Drake, I would certainly wash your hands after you're done in here. I mean, we're on a waterfall, so it's very easy to do so. But, God knows how long this has been here. Uh, okay, going deeper into the boat. There is a body up ahead. What happened to him? Yeah. 
Oh, we've got some gold. Get this, my decomposing friend. I couldn't read what it said then. There were some inscriptions on there. The coins of some sort. I wonder what happened to that guy. Just got warm again. How so? Well, I just met a guy with pockets full of Spanish gold. Only the coins are stamped with a mint mark I've never seen before. You're kidding me. Looks like our German friends had a little secret. Okay, we've got another door to get through. Okay, we're starting to submerge now. Looks like the boat is sort of half underwater. I bet this is cold as well. I bet this is freezing. Okay, we've got another ladder. Where are we now? Cozy. Alright, so we've got daylight coming through from somewhere. Where's the captain? I'm in the captain's quarters. Get this. He's still here. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> what do you think? He's alive? Ripped to shreds, actually. Oof, what a way to go. What happened to him? Take his wallet. You're all hearts, Sully. So it was about looting those corpses, especially if they're 400 years old. Oh, we've got a map. No way. To what? You've got to be kidding. Find anything, kid? UK 2642. UK. UK. UK 2642. Looks like we're going to south coast of America. Are you all right? <laughs> Sully, you're not going to believe this. Try me. I think I found our missing page. Looks like Drake and our German pals were after the same treasure. And I've got the map that's going to lead us right to it. Nate, this better not be another wild goose chase. We've got to get something out of this trip, or... Or what? Uh-oh. Sully? You there? What's happened to him? Sullivan. You know it's serious when he calls him Sullivan. What's happened? Someone found him? Did he see something he didn't like? We need to find out what's happened to him. So we've got, a, we've got a, a map that will lead, hopefully, to the statue. So UK seemed to suggest it was maybe just off the coast of South America, like southern Argentina, maybe. Oh, that's not good. That's Is that still active? Oh, I think it might be. Hello. Hello yourself. You didn't say hello there. Hey, hey. Friends of yours, Sully? I'm Gabriel Roman. Yeah, I know who you are, asshole. Manners, young man. This is just business. Get off there. Easy. Put your hands up. All right, they're up. See, your friend owes me money, Mr. Drake. A lot of money. Okay. So when you told me that you two were onto something big, the find of a lifetime, he said, well, I was intrigued. But he's made grand promises before, haven't you, Victor? And here we are again. Another fool's errand. Jeez, does he always go on like this? Ah, take it easy, Navarro. <laughs> so, I'm afraid the time is up. Unless, of course, you found something in there, Mr. Drake. 
that might compensate for all this unpleasantness. His screw under the innate, they heard everything. Just give them the map. Slowly. So this is the guy that um, Sullivan has a debt to, to pay towards then. What, you think this is a coincidence? The Germans were after the same treasure. That map has something to do with it. So, we square? For now. But just in case you need a reminder... Hey, come Ooh. on, leave him out of it. Yeah, don't you guys usually just cut off a finger or something? That's far too vulgar. No, I think this will hurt him a bit more. Now, whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, Roman. He's got nothing to do with that. Sully! Oh, okay. <laughs> what was he doing on the ship? Looking for something, let you fight that soldier guy. Yeah, leave him. You're gonna get killed as well. If you don't run off. Oh, uh, no. here we go. Okay. We need to move. Uh, okay, we don't have a gun anymore, so we're on foot, we're unarmed. Well, that seemed to be the end of Sully. Oh dear. Whoa there, cowboy. That's me at the I mean, we had that coming. You're down to one tomb robber now. Sully's dead. What? Yeah. And we're next if we don't get out of here. Oh, God. I'm, I'm sorry. Please tell me you have a gun. Of course. Oh, right, come on. I think we had that punch coming, but unfortunately, yeah. They shot and, and they shot Sully. I think they were going to, but um, yeah. Sully said that he made a few bad deals and... Unfortunately... Yeah, I can see them. <laughs> You're not helping. <laughs> this is what I find funny about these games is that they'll start running through. Right, can we can we melee this guy? I see them. Right, that's that guy I dealt with. Move, move. Suck. So Oh, headshot. Has that guy got a helmet on? Nice shooting, Elena. Okay, I think the other guy might have moved on. You always seem to be getting shot at. Yeah, we do. They're shooting at you too, you know. Only because you're here and associated with me. Come on, Drake. Okay. Oh, that's an SMG. We're an AK-47. So we can change between our handgun and an AK-47 now, which is good. Nice. Right, I think square is also reloads. Um, but yeah, Sully said that he made a few bad deals, and it looks like one of those was to, to Mr. Roman. So you can run and gun as well. Um, if you're like, you know, in a bit of a tight spot, you can run and gun. But, you know, for the most part, you want to try and aim. I think there are trophies uh, linked to, you know, killing people via run and gun and via um, aiming and headshots and different weapons and things like that. We've got grenades that we're going to start picking up later in the game as well. So much like there was with, uh, with Bioshock, you know, you've got trophies linked to killing people with various different weapons. Oh, no, I'm going to shoot you in the back of the head if you're not careful. All 
Okay, I don't see anybody else yet. Drake! Oh, I was trying to jump. <laughs> you have to like press X to go forward. You have to press X to like sort of move forward when you're covering. So, you know, we kind of fell. We, we did fall. We didn't kind of fall. We just fell. I don't know how she tracked us down, though. I mean, she must be pretty good herself to to find out exactly where we went. Because what the hell is this place anyway? Long story. Tell you later. Right, we can go straight through. Don't need to worry about dropping down there anymore. Still don't know if we can get that treasure or not. I might have to replay on a hard difficulty to get that one. That's a good. And we're dead. Okay. It got very dark there. I thought maybe I should turn the brightness up a little bit. I think for you guys it might still be a bit dark because of the... Actually, no. It's probably bright enough. Because of like game capture and stuff, it does tend to make it darker. So, we'll see. You can also do this and you can you can shoot without really looking because it will keep you in cover. So that works as well. That goes down. Oh! <laughs> I, feel, I don't remember what the reload button is or even if there is one. <laughs> and I ended up just standing up and just <laughs> looking like a sitting duck. So there we go, that works. You can run and gun. And then with this guy, again, you don't have to aim. You can run and gun or you can just peek over and shoot like that. Is he dead? No, not quite. There, now he is. You can hopefully AK-47 that guy. I think easy difficulties, I think you do get aim assist. What's the reload button? I don't remember. Oh, R1. There we go. Oh, Elena actually killed someone. Good job. dead uh, I think we have all the ammo that we can get we do since to get out of here and then work out where we're gonna go next Never a dull moment, huh? just keep your head down these guys aren't messing around so we gotta, there was a ladder wasn't there to get up there it is Oh, we could have just gone around the other way. Unnecessary scenic route. Okay, he's dead. Oh yeah, they're stuck throwing grenades. We should be okay from that. I mean, yeah, uh, we were, but only just. Oh, did I get him? I think I got him. 
one thing you can try and do with the grenades is try and catch them as they're throwing it. And also, can we break that? Is that explosive? No, it's not. Okay, I couldn't remember. Drake! Get him. Ooh. Okay, job done. Who are you firing out? I killed him. Come on. Ugh. Back this way. I wasn't sure if I was going to make that then or not. Oh, oh, I thought I got him in the head again there. I did get him though. And I need to get the guy that... Oh, no. Oh. I had to move forward, I think, to get that guy. There we go. See, Elena actually helps out. Elizabeth in Bioshock, you know, very much couldn't get damaged, can take care of herself, but didn't actually fight. Although she did give you health and stuff. This game health regenerates itself. But Elena does actually play a part in actually killing enemies, which is good. We're almost out. Stay with me. Very nearly there. Okay. So we're out in the open again. Right, we're going to jump back down and recover that health. Elena, you okay there? Yeah, she can't get damaged either, which is good. Uh, right, where is everybody? Elena, move. There we go. The annoying thing about this is that I don't, I don't remember where the bad guys are. There's one. Nice headshot. Over here, I think. Yeah, this way. What? What are you looking for? Oh wait, have you got a? Is that yours? Did you? Did you? Oh, you're actually brought a jeep. Nice job. Do seem to attract the scum of the earth. Uh, you know, no offense. Not taken. Do you have a good memory? Yeah, why? UK 2642. You got that? Yeah, what is it? It's Creek's Marine coordinates. I think I know where the Spanish took El Dorado. El Dorado? The problem is, so that the bastards killed Sully. Damn it! If the Spanish found the treasure, they had to move it there, to that island. And Drake followed them. Well, what are we waiting for? I'll get the story, and you get... Whatever it is you're after. <laughs> Come on. Hey, this isn't going to be a vacation, you know. I can take care of myself. We've Besides, seen that already. You owe me one. I suppose I do. Is this our truck or is it Elena's? I actually don't know. We're on our way to the island. We're on the trail of the lost treasure of El Dorado. Oh, she's vlogging. Oh, dear. To this tiny island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Let's get a closer look. Yeah, at the island, not at me. <laughs> Will we discover the ruins of a forgotten colony and a fortune in Spanish gold? Or does the island have darker secrets in store for us? She's better at this than I am. I mean, she is a professional journalist. What the hell was that? Anti-aircraft fire? This is so not cool! Who the hell is firing at us? Oh, crap. We're on fire. Yeah, don't film that. Don't help at all. <laughs> yeah, put it away. I would hope so. I hope any aircraft has parachutes of some sort. I hope these things still work. That's my packed lunch. <laughs> Of course. You just jump, 
I would hope that Drake jumped out of a plane with his exploring experience. Or in the sea, if we miss the island. Yeah, Drake, you might actually want to jump out. Okay, she is deployed. That's good. What am I doing? Yeah, get out of the plane. You are going to die. <laughs> Make sure that's a parachute and not just a rucksack. Okay, Drake obviously has never jumped out of a plane before. That surprises me. <laughs> That's a fast count to five. Oh, good. We get the the bad parachute. <laughs> it's fine. It's not real. It's not a weeping angel either. Don't blink. How's it hanging, Drake? Well, at least it was a good landing. Well, that's where the pr plane crash landed. Strangers trying to kill me, leave my map on a burning plane. The plane is missing, most likely dead. That's great. Great start, mate. Well, that's Sully and Elena that we seem to have lost now. And we're going to end things here. Um, I feel like these videos might be a bit shorter than other... Uh, so we're going to end things there. I feel like these uh, videos might be slightly shorter than they have been on previous series. Just because I think uh, doing it chapter by chapter might be easier. Um, so you might end up with some slightly shorter videos. But that does mean more parts and more videos. So, um, you know... It's probably going to be the same, same number of time, but yeah, there might, there, there might be shorter videos and more parts, but we'll wait and see. But we're going to, that's a good uh, time to end things off, I think. We've managed to, to well, pretty much escape unharmed. Can't see the same about Elena, though. I don't know where she's gone. Uh, so we're on the island. Hopefully, this is where El Dorado is, but we're going to have to go and find Elena, first of all, see if she's still okay. And then see if we can find where this treasure is. It's somewhere on this island. So we just need to work out where it is. Um, but we're going to end things there. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, do drop a like and leave comments. It's the best way to support and help the channel. If you haven't done so already or if you're new, then do subscribe. Turn on notifications. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to get our lunch back or not. Maybe there's some sandwiches in there. We might be on this island for a long time. But who knows. Um, that's going to do it for today, guys. Thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.